few exceptions, natural gas has been finally restored to all customers of the New Mexico gas company affected by the disruption. And that includes customers in the Española, Taos, and Red River areas who'd been without heat for almost a week. The homes and businesses have been canvassed and the gas is back on except for those without anyone at home. All of the shelters in those communities are now closed. Governor Susana Martinez says the crisis will cost the state more than $2 million, but she expects FEMA to pay for most of that. It continues to be cold in northern New Mexico and the rest of the state, too, but the most recent winter storm has left us behind. The storm dumped new snow here in Santa Fe in the East Mountains, where many schools closed today, and blizzard conditions shut down I-40 eastbound at Tucumcari until about 8.30 this morning. New Mexico 275 north of Clovis remains closed at this hour. Well, the storm is gone, but the cold remains. Let's check in with meteorologist Kristen Van Dyke and her first forecast. Kristen?